TV. Okay, so Young Buck and his former best friend who turned arch nemesis are currently going back and forth again. I mean, this story even goes back to well over 20 years ago before they dropped a hot song called Back On Up and Give Me Room on their collab album titled Thug Until The End. And this tape was flaming and making waves around Tennessee and just the South in general. Before Young Buck would drop and multi-platinum albums under 50 Cent label G U. And Young Buck initially brought Tay with him too. Young Buck featured him on a song with two on Straight Outta Cashville. They both brought platinum plaques back to the hometown. And Young Buck even had d Tech rocking the stage with him too when he went out on tour. But according to d Tech, Young Buck didn't even pay the dude even though 50 Cent told him to. Fast forward to 2024, your boy d Tech still be around 50 Cent and Juvie the same way Young Buck used to. And then this video tape even states that he seen Young Buck and it was cool since the last time they ran into each other and got into it. And since then, d Tay mentioned Young Buck in a few interviews and Young Buck still be dissing d Tay in his music. And then this video, I'ma let y'all witness Young Buck and d Tay still going back and forth on social media. Hey David, what? You never seen to amaze me, brother. You the biggest killer in the city that ain't never shot nobody. You the biggest gangster, the biggest crip that never banged on nobody. You the biggest motherfucking hustler that never had your own motherfucking sack. David, let's be honest. Your whole album was lies. Black gloves, black mask, he dead, you next. You ain't killed nobody. Where the black gloves at? I'm gonna be honest. You ain't even had a real fight. I used to beat you up. I used to beat you up, David. I DDT you off the porch. I say, man, why the he still talking about you? I say, what you talking about? I done seen this nigga out there, everything, what's happening? I ain't seen him or nothing, what's up? Man, look at this. DT, that ain't get you broke. Yeah. Come on, I probably was, bro. You feel me? I probably was. I got my own kingdom, homie. You probably live with a bitch. I'm on your ass, nigga. If can't nobody get on your ass, I can, nigga. Damn the 50 cents and the cook-up bosses and all that. Detail on your ass, David. You asked for it. You gonna post about me in 2024. Okay, well, here we go. I'm gonna eat spaghetti on your goddamn plaque. And you see how you point? You see how you point on them? Well, get what? The joke's on you. Hey, man. Man, and they shouldn't have never showed your that's how the crip walk, bro. Cause that's about the most cripping you gonna get. God damn it. You don't go to the meetings out there with Big U now. You ain't go to Nipsey Hustle funeral. You can't be a true 60, David. You didn't go to the funeral with Nip. Come on, man. Stop all this. You crip walking, man. Come on, man. I'll be over there 10 toes down. Shout out to Uncle Fat Rat, man. Matter of fact, shout out to Uncle Big U, man. Hey, hey, um, Big U, I need that rematch on that pool table, too. See, yeah, David, you can't run the people and shit. Uh, that's my uncle, too. Well, you know it's all love me. Look, quit that shit and quit grip walking. Quit that shit and quit wearing that goddamn jacket. That goddamn coat. It ain't that coat. Ain't that the same coat on the video? You damn. Boy, you the love to put the blame on everybody else, man. Junkie son of a bitch. God damn it, you was a junk and some of a bitch, man. But everybody else was a junk. Yeah, we was partying and shit. But you was doing all the damn drugs, bro. We couldn't do them myself. Good thing a nigga just had some fly water. <laughs> junk and some of a bitch. Nigga wanna talk about some gay shit. Nigga, y'all niggas is the ones that's gay. I ain't looking for you, but I'm gonna catch you. I can see you in the grocery store, nigga. I can catch you on one of your routes. You up, nigga. They run and go tell that. The funny part about these people know I ain't playing. The real ones. Y'all do all that old play play with these. Go get your kiki, key key, your laughs, and your likes, and your comments, nigga. So I'ma get mine when I catch you. Now you can't come outside because I'm on that bullshit now. So I can't see you, nigga. I dare you to pull up. I dare you to let me run into you, nigga. We gonna see what this shit do. I gave you niggas enough time. I'm sick of I got kids. You niggas some tough ass groupies. The detail ass out here, bro. I'm gonna come scoop down to you niggas level. When I catch you, I'm smacking you niggas. I'm jacking you niggas.
this. I'm doing whatever y'all wanna do. I'm smacking you, jacking you, taking whatever you got in your little pockets, and knocking your ass out. And if you act like you wanna take it any further than that, we shoot. Don't try to use my name for your views, man. I can't care. I can't see you, nigga. I can't see niggas in the grocery store. I've been not seeing niggas at the gas station. Especially D Tape Po ass. If you can pick up your phone and call 50 right now, you po ass. I'll give you a hundred thousand right now, po ass, if you pick up the phone. You ain't even got his nigga number, bro. And all you other podcast looking for a few niggas, I'ma just smack the shit out of y'all. I'ma smack the shit out of you, you bloggers. Let me get out of here. I think my PO done took me. <laughs> Man, so when I say this whole young buck beef thing is getting extremely heated, I really mean it, you feel me? I mean, he talking about smacking the bloggers and checking their pockets and everything. Young buck and finished two times and got tired of us damn bloggers talking about them in our damn videos. But me personally, when I blog, I don't ever talk negative about nobody though. I just tell shit how it is, and if you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. And as soon as I figure out any more information about the situation, I'ma let you know. But until then, I gotta let you go. I had to make it look juicy for Trap to TV. Oh!